Boys and girls, good morning. Happy Martin Luther King Day. Today we are looking at the lighthouse, one of the many lighthouses in our world. And this one is in Currituck County. It's the Currituck Lighthouse that's located in Corolla, North Carolina. And North Carolina is our neighbor to the south of Virginia. We're going to be checking out some historical buildings. And let's go find out some fun facts about the Corolla Lighthouse, shall we? Excuse me, the Currituck Lighthouse. So I'm walking up to the path and I'm looking at these oysters that they are using for the pathway. Oysters are a great use of sustainable living. And we grow oysters in first and fourth grade and our oyster float is in the Virginia Aquarium in Owls Creek. And once we grow our oysters, then we will transfer them to the waters to grow an oyster reef. All right, let's check out this beautiful view of the lighthouse. Let's go read some facts about the lighthouse and then I'll show you a bigger view of it. So let's go check this out. I'm gonna read some facts about this lighthouse. It is 162 feet tall, wow. Ooh, I can see a year, 1873. So boys and girls, if you were to do the math, it is about 145 years old. And there are 220 steps and two, um, 102 of them are made out of iron to the top. And there is an outdoor gallery which you can look out into the ocean. There are some open stairs. And I'm gonna show you, um, there's actually birthday cards here for the lighthouse to celebrate its 145th birthday. Okay, so this, let's see if I can find any other fun facts. Let's go check out this closer. There's those oysters that lead all the way up. The lighthouse right now is closed for winter and it will reopen in mid-March. Let's go check out, it's nestled underneath these beautiful trees and over across the way is a historical building that the lighthouse keeper and his family, usually a he, but he or she live. Let's go check out a larger view of this lighthouse because it is so extraordinarily beautiful. And there it is against the blue sky. You can see that at the top at night, there's a light that's a beacon. That's another word for a beacon of light that shows the seamen or women that live in the boats and come in the boats for safety to our shores. And you can see there are windows going up. You can see it's made out of bricks. It's very, very tall and spectacular. Just a few um, guests for now that are here, but I'm looking up boys and girls and it's very, Awesome. That is a wondrous sight. So thank you for exploring the lighthouse with us. There are many things to look at in Corolla, North Carolina, which is our beautiful neighbor. I'm gonna go check out the sign and some other interesting facts because I like to explore and learn. In Virginia Beach, we have a lighthouse called the Cape Henry Lighthouse, which I hopefully will show you that in the future. So there it is, gorgeous view. And here's the sign. I wanted to show you the sign that says Currituck Beach Lighthouse. And there's a sign that shows the direction where the lighthouse is. 
let's look at another view of the lighthouse out here where it's nestled in these beautiful wax myrtles and pine trees and live oaks. Beautiful view. There it is. All the way up, you can see barely through those trees. And look over here. And then I'll get you some pictures to send your way so you could really check it out and really study the details of it. There you go.